Police officers are going to be honored today around the nation. Uh, a local event, in fact, is planned in Palm Springs during this National Police Week. It's honoring its fallen officers. News Channel 3's Crystal Jimenez is live in Palm Springs with more on this local event. Crystal. Jeff, we're right outside the Palm Springs Police Department right now. This is where several people are be are going to be joining the department to honor those fallen officers. You can see the memorial behind me. That's where all their names are right now. The officers being honored tonight will be fallen officers Eldridge, Larrabee, Zarebny, and Vega. Officer Eldridge, he was the first Palm Springs police officer to die in the line of duty. That happened back in 1961. Then there was Officer Larrabee. He had died in 1962 during a vehicle pursuit. Years later in 2016 is when officers Zarebny and Vega died. The two officers were responding to a domestic dispute when they were shot. This memorial ceremony is going to happen at 5 p.m. The public is invited to attend. Not only do we have this memorial going on, but also there is one happening in Washington, D.C. on Friday. It's the 34th annual candlelight vigil. This is where hundreds of names of officers killed in the line of duty are engraved on the National Law Enforcement Officers Memorial. This event can be live streamed. You can find more information on KESQ.com. Some backstory on this week. National Police Week has been celebrated since 1962 after President Kennedy declared May 15th National Peace Officers Memorial Day. It's a way to honor both our fallen officers and those who are still with us protecting the streets. Live in Palm Springs, Chris Jimenez, News Channel 3. Important effort uh, underway today there again in Palm Springs. Thanks so much.